Okay, now we're gonna go over five moves that we can use right off this lift into this cross. Okay, so again, we're gonna be in motion steps. What I want you guys to understand is the ability to float the ball and have motion steps are gonna give you options. So right now we're gonna go over five options, right, off that lift cross, right, when I'm in these motion steps, right, that you can use in any situation, right, in any game. Okay, so let's go through these right now. All right, now, first one we're gonna go over is a heavy step, right? So as I cross, right, I wanna lift, right? I'm right, left, wide base. When I cross over right now, if that defender is maybe locked onto my hip, okay? I wanna have the ability off this left step to slow as that ball floats, right? Off that heavy step, I'm gonna read. So now maybe I'm in a heavy step situation where I cross, I got defender, help. As I'm lifted in that heavy step, that defender starts to slide back. I have that ability to now tack into that gap to the rim. Okay, so a heavy step is gonna slow us down, right? Our foot is gonna stay in the floor as that ball floats, right, over the top. Okay, so let's take a look at that cross, right, into our heavy step. Okay, we can manipulate our eyes where we want on this. Now off this lift cross, right, when I lift, right, right, left loading, want to cross over. Now as I run, if my defender's running with me, okay, and on and attached to my hip, right, I want to be able to step left, ball's floating, and I want to punch that ball on my right to slow my pace. So as they're coming across and not going across my frame to where I have to exchange it, they're staying on the inside, I want to be able to punch that ball, right, protecting it from that defender, slowing my pace. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is that defender, when we punch it, stays on our hip. I'm gonna get into a delayed drop, and then I wanna attack the rim. So a delayed drop right now is gonna give us a chance to read. Within the delayed drop, we're gonna have another lift moment real quick. Back foot, front foot, and then I wanna attack. So our lift is gonna give us chances to read our defender right within this punch drag. <laughs> Now another option off our punch, right, while we're lifted, when I punch this ball, right, I'm in that drop stance, when I lift right now, if that defender now goes across my frame, punch, I'm lifted, left, right, if they start to cross my frame, I can exchange, so I can exchange cross, right, I could exchange behind, right, I also can exchange through right now, right, the most important thing is our footwork looking the same, punch, left, right, Defender starts to shift their frame, right? Now I can come across. On this crossover, I wanna use motion steps again. So it's cross, right? I take that step, right foot, left foot, and then I wanna get right into that finish at the rim. Now I'm gonna Euro step now off this. So when I cross over, one, two off that left, defender crosses my frame, I'm gonna pick up off that left foot. Okay, now a skip step, right? It's almost the same thing we're doing off this cross, right? So right now, if I was to cross, Right, I'm almost skipping off this foot. So as I lift, right, I can lift right, left, I load, I cross over. 
Right now, is that ball float? One, two, those are my motion steps. I'm gonna go dribble step. If another defender is center frame on me, I'm gonna skip off my left. So I'm gonna dribble step, skip this foot outside my frame, right, as a shift move, right? The ball's gonna pull to my pocket, right, as I skip. So I wanna float, it's one, two, three, skip, and then I can attack downhill, right, into our finishes. Now off this cross, right, when we cross over, now when I step here, if I feel that defender start to come across my frame, right, so maybe they jumped and now they're starting to sprint to a spot to recover quick, right, across my frame, I wanna step right as that ball floats and drag the ball under my leg to create space. First thing we're gonna do when we drag it, I wanna get into a foot switch. So I'm gonna pull my right foot behind my frame, lifting off my left, and then I'm right left into that drop and we're gonna attack. So right now we wanna work on maintaining that space with that foot switch. So here, right, I foot switch. This, when I land here, gives me options and ability to read my defender. Okay, let's take a look at it. 